Welcome back, Pipers. Hobbit and Piper Kevin here, coming to you from the Arkansas River Valley in America. I just recently had the blessing of being sent to Ireland for business. But on the weekend, I was able to take some leisure time and explore some of the Irish countryside and also explore Dublin. And at Dublin, there's a very special place for those of us who are into pipe smoking, and that is Peterson of Dublin. Now, if you don't know much about Peterson, um, their website says they are the oldest continuously operating briar pipe factory in the world. And these are Irish people creating Irish products using Irish traditions that have now dated back 150 years and in fact there's silversmiths there they even go through a apprenticeship process that can be four to eight years long so um, they do take it very seriously and if you look back at the history back in 1874 Frederick Cap he moved his pipe retail operation from London to Dublin Dublin Ireland and he opened a new pipe and tobacco shop there. And he began selling pipes made of meerschaum and of briar. And so within that first year, he hired an assistant, a young woodworker named Charles Peterson. And over time, they developed this operation into an international export factory with a legacy of craftsmanship now dating back, like I said, 150 years. So the retail store and factory, it has moved and changed ownerships over the de decades. And uh, in fact, in 2018, the parent company that owns Cornell and Deal and SmokingPipes.com, uh, they purchased the retail operation the uh, retail store and factory. And so these products have become very accessible now, very available. And in fact, you can, you can find any of them really online. But I thought, how neat would it be while I'm there to walk into that Dublin retail store and talk to the associates there and look out across their selection there in the showroom and see if there was a pipe that spoke to me. And if so, to purchase that and bring it back to the States. So, went to Dublin, went to the store, and I wanted this experience to be as natural as possible. So I didn't video everything, but I had to video something because I really wanted to share this with you. So I took some video, a few video clips, a few pictures. So here we go. Let's go to Dublin and take a look.
hook. I really like this one. Yeah. But um, this just kind of feels like it lays in my hand. I like the way it does. I like the balance on it. And then I'm assuming not too many days of rest after this, is it? No. <laughs> <laughs> That's good, you're not flying out right away anymore. Yeah. We did we did have some good fun uh, Wednesday night. And then uh, colleagues brought us down, so broke us in properly. <laughs> Showed you what Dublin City had to offer. Yes. Yeah, there's quite a few. Let me just start by saying that Connor and Janji, who were the retail associates there that day, they were so incredibly nice, so incredibly friendly, really just amazing, amazing, uh, just a great experience. You know how sometimes you'll go into a, a shop and you almost feel like you're bothering them, you almost feel like they wonder why you're there and they don't really seem overly eager to serve you. <laughs> well, the exact opposite is true there at Peterson of Dublin. They treat you like you're their most honored guest and it was just an amazing experience. Uh, those two guys were fantastic and uh, really made the experience so memorable and enjoyable. So let me see if I can show you this. This is the little bag that they gave me that it came in. And within that bag was a, a box, and here's the card. Mike can scan that QR code and see something cool. Everything's green, a green theme. <laughs> the Emerald Isle, and it is very green there. Beautiful. This is the Peterson Irish Harp Sandblasted 606 Fish Tail. You can see that this pipe is a straight pot. I'm really starting to enjoy that shape a lot. Really starting to enjoy it a lot. And I'm looking at more and more pipes with that type of shape. Very thick insulating walls you can see here. Wide tobacco chamber. A very concise sandblast. I really enjoy a good sandblast on a pipe dark walnut stain with this matching acrylic stem and look at this sterling silver band this particular series pays tribute to an iconic item in ireland an iconic symbol which is the Celtic harp. So really nice silver work there. I'll show you some more up close pictures of this at the end. 
and I will be smoking this in an upcoming video with some more beautiful footage of Ireland so be sure to subscribe and uh, click the notification bell so that you're notified when that is released it'll take me a little time to put it together but it'll, it'll be fun when that does come out so the Peterson Irish Harp Sandblasted 606 was the one that spoke to me that day and I now have it back with me here to enjoy so thank you for being here I really appreciate it like I said more fun videos are on the way so until we talk again go enjoy some good food good drink and a good pipe